Hey everyone, and welcome back to King's Quest 3 to Aeris Human. So last episode we did uh, quite a bit of um, spell casting. We made a whole bunch of spells, and yeah, that's pretty much what we did. So this episode, hopefully, well I know actually we're going to uh, kill, kill Mananen, pretty sure, because he just got back from his journey, and now he asked for food. And we're going to give him the porridge and have him. Mananan is impatiently waiting for his food. His stomach rumbles and drums in our fingers. Or dire consequences may result. Mwahaha. Give porridge. Porridge. Oops. Give porridge. They are not hungry. What? what are you talking about? They're not hungry. Yeah. Wizard. Poor. Rich. You place the food on the dining table. But uh, why can I speak? You place the food on the dining table before the hungry wizard. Ravenously, he devours every bit of it. Yes. Eat the porridge. Yes. <laughs> Oh, yes. Keep eating. Eat all of it. Every last bit of it. You fooled him. Mananan didn't realize the porridge was tainted and ate the whole bowl. Good for you, you freaking wizard. Oh, no, he's a buddy. Congratulations. Mananan will never ever again enslave you or the people of Ludor. At last, you are free. Look at you. Where are you? Look at you, kitty cat. Ha ha ha. Now he's like, meow, meow. I don't know what to do. Where am I going? Meow, meow. I'm a cat. Meow. Ha ha ha. Good for you, man and then. Now we're gonna save the game. The, the wizard cat. There we go. Now. And now we must go to our room. Are you excited that you have a new friend to play with, kitty? I bet you are. Do, do, do. We're when we are going to teleport to the village. Six and show it shall be. Now let's go into the tavern. Open door. Oh, hello. Pirates? We got pirates. One of the rowdy seamen yells to the barmaid, Wench, come her here with more rum. Hola. Nice. So, do I have to talk to the captain? The sailors peer at you through bleary eyes and continue sw swile swilling their rum. One, who looks like the captain, pauses and drunkenly slurs, Ay, hey, me bucko, be a wanton passage on me ship. What you running from? Aw, snow matters. Long as you got gold. Let me see how much you got. Captain Gold. Okay, give captain. The drunken sea captain looks angry as he asks Xen, Don't ignore me, laddie. I asked you how much gold you got for patches on me ship. Give captain the gold. I don't know. Give him my gold. What's a him? Too late, bucko, the sea captain slurs. I ain't interested in you no more. Go rest, pester someone else. What? How am I supposed to... Look in pouch. I don't even know how much gold do I have. Where the heck's my... Purse and gold coins. You eagerly peek inside the soft leather coin purse and discover it contains some shiny gold coins. You may want to count them. 
count gold coin coins. Yeah, four gold coins. Captain four gold coins. Talk to Captain. The sailors just ignore you. Ah, now we gotta like restore game. Freaking heck. Frick. Fine. I guess we'll just go. Oh, their ship is here. I wonder if we could just like walk on it. Maybe. Hello. Talk to sailor. You politely speak to the old sailor on the dock. In response, he growls, Quit your yammering, boy. I ain't got no time for you. I gotta keep trespassers away from this here jolly boat. Scram. To sailor. Ugh. Maybe I have to give the pouch. Or maybe I have to give the purse to... Hey, hold on. Let's, let's try that. Oh my god. Why can't I spell? Fine. Screw you then. As you bring out the purse, the captain snatches it from your hand and says, Hey lad, I sees you do have a wee bit of gold. It's a less than me regular fare, but I'll gives you passage anyways. We'll be waiting for you at the wharf, but not for long. The captain and his men down their rum in one long drought, then leave the tavern. Wow, that was quick. Jeez, that took a long time. Like, it literally took me like ten, I, I swear to god, like ten tries just to like get, get past these silly pirates. All right, cool. Hello, I am here. Boop. As the grand plate is drawn and you hear the captain shout to this men, take his things and put him in the old until I figures out what to do with him. You have a sneaking suspicion that you have made a big mistake. These are pirates. Uh, that's true. Oh, typical pirate music. You gotta love it. Nothing like a little salt air to perk up a boy's spirits. All things being equal, you might have enjoyed this ocean voyage. However, you have found your accommodations to be slightly less than satisfactory. Uh, <clears throat> interesting. So now... What are we doing? Where, where are we? Can we get out? Huh. There we go. Take crate. I'm not sure what to do with this now. I'm just gonna carry it around. Oh. Please. Crate. Climb. I don't know. Crate. Whoops. Um, crate. Jump on crate. Jump on larger crate. What's this larger? Ugh. Listen to rats. Shh, if you're quiet, maybe you can hear them. Fine. Talk to rats. The little mice totally ignore your attempted conversation. You know the pirates buried treasure? You hear one of the mice say to the other? What about it? asked the second mouse. Says the first, well, I just heard the captain talking about it with one of his men. He said it was buried. Now let me see if I can remember. Oh, yeah. He said it was buried near a lone palm tree. From the palm, you walk five paces to the east and then start digging. 
Too bad we can't do anything about it, muses the other mouse. Yeah, too bad. I guess the treasure will have to go to somewhere else, someone else. Maybe someone like me. Hmm? Simone Crate. And... <clears throat> okay, maybe we gotta put it. Oh my god. Take crate. Put crate there. Jump crate. Jump crate. God damn it. Jump up. Jump. Great. Ugh! Why isn't this working? Hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. Whoa! Um, all right, well, I guess that worked. Now, um, not sure what to do. We're going to save the game. The pirates. We're gonna climb up, boo ba doo ba doo Oh, okay, good. Poof. So we gotta go get our stuff. Um, the crate is on his bed. Right there. The crate, we gotta... Is this the crate? God. Open crate. What the heck? Open. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. Uh oh, okay. I thought he wasn't gonna be. Open crate. Freaking open! Oh my god. Do I have to be like standing right here? Open. 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 Ugh. Open. Box. Freaking heck. Open. Just this is dumb. Take all. You found all of your missing possessions. You take them with you. Good. Now we can save. We gotta go this way. Oh no, one of the crew has spotted you. You'd better run. Oh, freaking heck. Oh no. Run. Crap. Okay. Now we gotta take the shovel. Look at the beds. They're so, like, that's crazy. Take shovel. There we go. I wait for the captain to say something. To lower the anchor? So yeah, we're just gonna wait here for a little while. I'm just drinking my tea. And hopefully it won't be too long. Oh, you hear one of the pirates shout, Land ho, Captain! You're gonna drop the anchor? You're gonna drop the anchor soon? We're waiting for a while. You heard the first May shout, drop anchor and prepare to go ashore. Finally. All right. Now we have to. Poor sleeping. Whoa. Hold on a second. We're going to save the game just in case. Powder. Floor. Okay. Slumber. 
Hence, four, fourth. As your sleep spell takes effect, a silence suddenly descends over the ship. Jump crate. Jump crate. Jump crate. Oh, you freaking jerk. Oh my god. Ha. All right. Doop a doop a doo. And now we gotta go up. Now we gotta go up. Up another s one. Yeah, you're silly. All right. Freaking Gwydion. Like, relax. We got to leave. Gotta get off this ship. Your climbing skills are amazing. Oh, sleep it. Then we gotta jump. Boom. Oh dang, 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 oh All right, what are we supposed to do on this beach, anyways? Ah. Oh, okay. So we are at the palm tree. Then count. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. Um, dig. I don't know if this is... You dig and dig, but unfortunately find nothing. Dig. You're too close to the ocean to dig. The hole would fill up in too quickly. Okay. Dig. Oops, am I digging in the right spot? Oh, snap. You uncovered a small chest. You remove it from the hole and open it. Inside you find precious gems and ingots of gold and silver. You close the chest and take it and its contents with you. Huzzah! We found the treasure. Alright, I guess this is um, enough for this episode. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. And please give it a thumbs up or a like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you in the next episode. Bye!